Hey Duck fans! Bet you didn't expect to see this channel again, huh? I've taken as much time as I've needed, and I've been anxious to get videos back up and entertaining you all. This Memorial Day, I decided we could cover two short propaganda cartoons from World War II that are almost an original and a remake. We've got The Spirit of 43, starring Donald Duck, and The New Spirit from 1942. The funny thing is that it feels like The Spirit of 43, which came after The New Spirit, felt like the original with how much shorter and less informative it was, while the new spirit sounds like a follow-up with more to it, including a song specifically for the cartoon. The new spirit and the spirit of 43 both cover the same topic, which is how the true patriot pays their income tax. As this is very much propaganda, there's quite a bit of let's destroy the axis talk, but it doesn't really cloud the actual point of how important paying your taxes is. The Spirit of 43 shows us Donald Duck in two aspects of his financial mind. He's apparently got a version of Scrooge McDuck in there telling him to save, while there's another duck in high-waisted pants telling him to spend his money on frivolity. It takes a good clunk to his head to see the door to irresponsible spending is the wrong path, but he gets it in the four minute short. The New Spirit, however, I like a bit better because it is more informative. We do get an opening song for the cartoon, sung by Cliff Edwards, best known as the voice of Jiminy Cricket, before he teases poor Donald Duck about how best he can serve his country as the average American. It's actually pretty funny how Donald is begging his radio to tell him how he can help his country. He's so dramatic. It's interesting to see that this cartoon shows us that Donald legally has adopted his nephews as he lists them as his dependents. He also lists himself legally single, which is actually important when filing your taxes. Something of note about this particular cartoon, it was commissioned by the Secretary of the Treasury at the time, a Mr. Henry Morgenthau Jr., as a way of showcasing the new Revenue Act of 1942. This isn't the first or only time the American government commissioned Walt Disney for propaganda, but it is still an interesting note all the same. Both The Spirit of 43 and The New Spirit end with the same two-minute spiel about how, how our taxes go to pay for guns. Lots of different guns. Today, that might not be the same sort of motivation the uh, average American cartoon watcher could use. Views have changed significantly since the 40s on what our taxes should be used for now. I'm also wondering if there was a third adaptation of either The New Spirit or The Spirit of 43, because I could have sworn that one of these ended with Snow White's seven dwarves standing in line to pay their own income taxes. Anyway, happy Memorial Day to those who observe it, and I am so excited to get back into making more videos in the future. Until next time, Duck fans.